In this video, we will learn how to convert a colored video to a black and white video using Filmora. So I have already imported my video into Filmora. I will start by placing this video on the timeline like this. I am going to choose the option match to media. Now let's preview the video first. As you can see this is a colored video and today we will be converting this video into a black and white video. So let's do it. So the process is very simple. I will double click on this video. I will go to the color tab and then I will scroll down to find two sliders. Vibrance and saturation. I will firstly decrease the value of vibrance to minus 100 and I will do the same for saturation as well. Then I will click on OK and just like that my video has been converted to a black and white video. Now I will undo the two steps which I just did and I will bring this video back to its original form. What if we want to create a video with cinematic transitions where the video firstly becomes black and white and then ultimately it changes back to its original form that is a colored video. We can do that as well. So let's do it. For that I will firstly zoom in on this video to have a better view of what we are going to do. Now I will bring this playhead to the beginning of the video. Now I will drag this playhead across the video and I will bring it to a point where I want my video to become black and white. I will make a split there. Then I will again drag this playhead and I will bring it to a point where I want my video to change back to its original color. I will make the second split there. Now my video is divided into three parts. I will select the one in the center. I will double click on that and again in the color tab I will decrease the value of vibrance and saturation to minus 100. I will click on OK. So now you can see the first video part is a colored one, second is a black and white and third is again a colored video. Now we will make this video look very awesome by applying transitions. So I will go to the transitions and here we have multiple options to choose from. You can choose the one you like. I am going to choose the transition warp zoom 3. I will apply this transition between the first and the second video like this and then I am going to choose the transition flash and I will apply this between the second and the third video. I will decrease the duration of these transitions because I want them to be very small in duration. So just like that I will decrease the duration of these transitions by dragging them from any of the corner. And just like that my final video is ready. Let's preview how this looks. If you find this video useful please give it a like, share your views in the comment section and please subscribe to the channel Cinematic Edits. Thank you so much.